The wealth of natural beauty and homegrown creative talent in South Africa is worth taking the time to explore. This week, we take a road trip to the Free State Highlands with media personality and social media influencer Umpumi Umplambo to discover what this unique area has to offer. Hey there, what's good? My name is Mbumi Mlambo, Umsagazwa Kumtanda Gakulu. We are out in the Free State in Clarence for the very first time with my photographer, Sim Stimi, on the side. We're creating amazing content here to check out the space. The weather is a little bit gloomy, but a girl came prepared, so let me go do what I need to do. <laughs> in a hood called Orange Farm. I guess that's the township that really cultivated me because that's where I got to do fun things like emceeing in primary school, also acting and dancing. It's been one of the most exciting places to be a part of and just the community is amazing and loving. That's the place that created me. I am a music enthusiast and music has found me in places like radio and TV. I am an award-winning broadcaster and I also just finished shooting one of the biggest music shows. Basically, everything that I do is centered around music. I'm into fashion as well, so I marry fashion and music. That's something that I'm extremely passionate about. So Clara's decided to just rain, but I've got my umbrella, which also matches with my drip, so I'm excited about that. How do I keep relevant right now? Social media definitely is the biggest tool for me to keep updated. I really, really love the fact that you can use Pinterest to check out on the latest trends on fashion, musical digital platforms on music, Instagram for drip, Twitter for political conversations. So social media is that one thing that I use to keep relevant. Big shout out to Mahone Zao for hooking up this amazing outfit for me. I'm looking absolutely snatching, if I have to say so myself. <laughs> I grew up in a street with two amazing artists coming out of South Africa, and that's Lebu Hang Sutole as well as Temba Kumalo. And being friends with these two artists sort of made it easy for me to be influenced with the arts. So wherever I go, I always make sure that I check out the local art scene. Today, we're out at the Blow Donkey Art Gallery, and I'm hearing that there's some amazing art that you and I are going to love. Let's go check it out. For many years, Clarence was known as the art mecca in South Africa. There was a lot of people that came specially to Clarence to buy their art. That has changed over the years and Clarence has become much more of a family destination with a lot more activities for the family to do. In 2007, we realized that there is a need for a contemporary art gallery here in Clarence. We didn't want to keep on focusing on the academic art, but we wanted the nice, big, bold art pieces from brilliant artists all over South Africa. We have some lovely, fun items like Angad, and we have some serious work from Al Garabi, which specializes really in portraits and also in wildlife. Then, as you can see behind me, we've got lovely pieces of Dani Mare, huge, bold pieces that people absolutely love. I can promise you that everyone will find something in the Blue Donkey Art Gallery that they will love. No visit to the countryside is complete without taking a moment to unwind. Our next stop is the Clarence Wellness Day Spa, where owner Janine Bills and her team are set to spoil our guest. Hi, I'm Janine Bills. I'm from the Clarence Wellness Day Spa, and this is where you come to relax in Clarence. I started Clarence Wellness Day Spa about 17 years ago, and I started all on my own doing the treatments, but I soon realized that I will need some help. So I came up with the brilliant idea of empowering locals in the area and start training them to do treatments. So from the one treatment room, we now boast five treatment rooms and we have about 12 locals that works with me at Clarence Wellness. We have an extensive range of spa treatments, but we do focus on the relaxation treatments. So we do a lot of massages, different types of massages. One of them is the hot stone massage and also the intonga massage where we use a stick to massage with. Taking time out to rest, reinvent is extremely important uh, because we work in such a busy industry. There's a lot happening, having to be on social media all the time, being stuck in traffic and just constantly on the go. So coming out to Clarence to experience this beautiful scenery of trees and mountains and just total silence, you're just hearing the birds has been absolutely beautiful for the mind, body as well. So also COVID-19 has been quite stressful. So I think it was very really important for me to, to invest in this. So yeah, I'm happy I'm doing it. 
Firstly, I have to say thank you for the welcome treat, the tea, as well as the amazing food scrub. But I'm excited about the hot stone massage. So with the kind of work that I'm doing, we stand a lot when we're emceeing, uh, when we're at photo shoots, there's also quite a lot of walking and stuff like that. So just to be lying down and have somebody put some hot stones on me and enjoy that in this cold weather is going to be phenomenal. So I'm quite excited. <laughs> With the hot stone massage, it increases your blood and your limb circulation, so you feel great afterwards. Also, it's eight times more effective than a normal massage because of the heat from the stones that you use to massage with. So she'll feel rejuvenated and fresh after the massage. My body is feeling really, really relaxed. I'm actually sleepy. <laughs> it's quite difficult to stay awake because it feels really amazing. It's been a cold day, so just having these hot stones in my body is amazing. They feel super warm in my body. And the pressure is amazing. And I just like, let me go back to sleep. It was an obvious choice to go with Capitec Bank as our merchant provider. They have the best competitive rates, but not only that, Kurnai and her team at Capitec always keep us updated with the newest technology and the upgrades that are available. Various payment methods are available at the spa, including scan to pay and tap and go. When you pay at Clarence Wellness Day Spa, you can tap or you can swipe. All made easy by Capitec. They also come in to do the necessary training, which makes our life so much easier. Clarence offers a wide range of diverse activities, but venturing just a few kilometers out of town, you will experience the magnificent surrounding landscape of the Maluti mountain range. I definitely know for sure that South Africa is the most beautiful country in the entire world. I've seen a couple of places, but Free State comes at number one for me. I'm out at the Golden Gates Highlands National Park and just experiencing the nature and seeing the Harte Beers, the Vestbork, as well as the zebras has been breathtaking for me. The mountains, I literally walked through the space, guys, and I almost cried. That's how mind-blowing the mountains were. We are in the Golden Gate Highlands National Park in the Eastern Free State. Really a stunning place to visit because of the number of activities one can do here. There are a variety of hikes, places to drive, wildlife to see very close within your vicinity. Very safe to hike because we don't have dangerous wild animals. We have stunning horse rides, which I'd hope to take and pull me on. But because of the rains, the paths are muddy and slippery, so we had to give that one a go for this time. So the name Golden Gate Highlands National Park, the first part, the Golden Gate part, is because of these sandstone cliffs that are orange and yellow, and when the sun sets, they really turn to gold. So that's the Golden Gate part. The Highlands part refers to the fact that this is the catchment area of the major rivers in South Africa. It is estimated that the rivers that are born here feed water to about 30% of South Africa. Okay, so this is the part of the day that I really don't like because that means I have to go home. But I want to be honest, I had an amazing time out in the free state. I have to say, it's a small town, but it has some wonderful experiences. The spa was amazing, the art gallery was amazing, these beautiful landscapes were amazing, and you've been amazing for tuning in to Insider SA. A big shout out to Insider SA for taking a girl out for a day, it's been amazing. Stand a chance of winning your own special date in Clarence with a midweek overnight stay and a couple's massage at the Clarence Wellness Spa. To enter, reply to the competition post on our social media pages using hashtag CapitechLiveBetter and tell us how you balance your physical and mental well-being around the daily challenges of life. The competition closes at midnight on Sunday, 11 April. T's and C's apply and can be found on the insidersa.co.za.